There's hope for thousands of children living with rare genetic disorders that can cause a lifetime of disability. It's a remarkable new approach to gene therapy that actually reprograms brain cells with new DNA. CBS 2's Dr. Max Gomez tells us how this procedure is changing the lives of these severely affected children. You cutie? Yeah. As an infant, Jamel Stagg Jr. wasn't hitting normal developmental milestones. At the three month mark, his pediatrician is the one actually who thought something was wrong. Jamel was eventually diagnosed with a rare genetic disorder called AADC deficiency, which leads to a loss of dopamine in the central nervous system. Dopamine fuels two important pathways in the brain one for motor function, and another that regulates mood and emotion. Without it, children born with this disorder suffer severe physical and developmental disabilities and require round-the-clock care. They sleep poorly. They have what are called oculogyric crises, which are akin to seizures. Uh, they have uh, very poor motor control, very poor motor movements. But now researchers at the Ohio State University Wexner Medical Center have successfully performed a groundbreaking gene therapy surgery that offers hope to those children and potentially many others with neurodegenerative diseases. They infuse a benign virus programmed with specific DNA into targeted areas of the brain, delivered slowly as doctors monitor its progress through real-time MRI imaging. Really what you're doing is you're introducing to the cell uh, a plan, uh, a, different, a different code. In the study, those painful sleepless nights that plague kids with AADC deficiency disappear. This is the first thing we see that goes away completely. Uh, remarkably, within a few weeks of the gene therapy, it never comes back. And in the months that followed, several patients were able to sit up, feed themselves, or even walk unprecedented improvements among children with this disorder. Just to be able to see him actually pick up a toy or something. It's going to be nothing but joy. This same method of genetic reprogramming could be used to treat other genetic disorders, as well as common neurodegenerative diseases like Parkinson's and maybe even Alzheimer's disease. Dr. Max Gomez, CBS 2 News.